Hey YouTube, what is up? JR Flores here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install your case from, I would say, this really cool company called Armor Suit. What they do is that they specialize in protecting your phone, and this company is made in the United States of America, which is a great name that you're getting from getting from the US quality brand that you can trust from. But what this thing is here, it's a, a skin, a special type of skin. This type of skin is called, I would say, it's supposed to protect your phone from uh, scratches and everything. That It's a wrap that basically goes out on your phone that's supposed to protect it from side to side. And this uh, product that they use is called carbon fiber, if I haven't mentioned it before. Carbon fiber is a very rigid but soft I would say smooth plastic. I like the way it already feels here as you can see. So let's install. So the first thing you need to do is have your hands clean. Once you clean your hands, you're going to need to clean your phone real quick with the microfiber shield to clean all around it as well and using the spray in order to get all the smudges and little imperfections in it and once you do that you want to take out your back case and remove your battery and put your battery aside just for precautionary measures and simply put your phone back case on your Galaxy S2 Epic 4G touch back and simply place it under this little tutorial instruction sheet here place it down and the next thing you would need to do is get your hands and wash them again. So once you uh, get your phone and your thing you simply want to spray it and clean it and wipe it down with its um, little microfiber cloth given to remove any nicks and anything like uh, scratches. We'll try to remove this is a special cleaning solution. So once you clean the back now what you want to do is clean all the sides all around it get all the buttons, everything, get all that dirt and grime off as you can see here you want to uh, remove some stuff here just want to go around and get it and get all around, especially around the camera area here as well and all these side ports here to remove every gunk or dirt and then go around in the front real quick and do that real quick and you simply place your phone back down in this position the next step you will need to do is simply remove the back cover off your Galaxy S2 and set your phone aside and get this back plate and get your screen shield and before you do that you want to wet your tips of your fingers really quick just so you can get any residue or oil off it and just rub that really quick and I got that on the case let me clean this here real quick from everything else whatever is still there and I removed that and now you want to simply get this and peel your uh, carbon fiber case off slowly as you can see here and simply you want to align it with the back plate of your phone like so so I'm going to try to align it as closely as possible and the good thing about it is that you could always remove it and align it back to position so I'm going to do this and when I'm done, I'll let you guys know. Once you simply get that there, I simply just place this here. And what you want to do is simply get your other shield here. And just, uh, I mean, get your other end here and simply go down across there. Simply rub that through here. And what you want to do now, because as you can see, these things are still right here open. You want to simply just push on the edges like this softly. So they could all go folded around the device. So you want to keep on doing that all the way around for this case. This shield. Okay, so just keep on pushing that all around the device. As you can see here, I want to get it nice and through. Make it stick. Okay, just keep on doing it on this side now. And you want to apply pressure to it, really good pressure so that it could stick around because as I can see, I don't know if you can see it, but this part that wants to come up, but you want to keep on applying pressure all the way around. 
even though some parts may not want to go, just keep on applying pressure and it will gradually go on. As you can see right here, you want to still simply push that through. So once this is done, you simply want to get your little squeegee tool provided and squeegee across going all directions of the side of the phone to accommodate this openness edges around the phone and to close them even tighter and have a tight seal. So once you do that, you want to go into your next step. The next step is to simply grab this bottom one and place it right below here, as you can see. So you simply want to place it right through here and as you can see you want to line it with the speaker phone here and simply go to the sides and curve right there as you can see and go up to the phone towards it here and let that curve touch it and go up again and repeat it for these sides here and you simply just want to push the sides to give it a nice foundation to grab upon on simply just go up so you can see and do use your squeegee and go that onto the side. So the next thing once you do that is you want to get your sides here, your side ports. So you want to get this port side here which goes to this side as you can see here for your power button and simply align that there. So once you get your strip you simply want to align it right here going straight forward. So once you do that, you simply want to, once it's placed all around this device here you, on this edge, you simply want to push and snug it all across here on the device to make it nice and smooth. And the next thing you need to do is grab your other side and simply place it along this edge. So once you do that, you want to get this last remaining part and simply put that up on top of here. So once you have that on, you simply want to get your squeegee and squeegee all this around and again repeat this process for every single part all around the whole phone to ensure the protection and how strong it stays. So once you have the whole shield installed besides the front screen, you would want to get a blow dryer and put on the lowest setting and on you see on these rounded edges here while they're still not fully on but they're on somewhat. You want to get a blow dryer and blow dry their area to make this uh, device more, I would say, that little protective thing, carbon fiber, more uh, uh, more a bendy bowl, so it could go around. And once you do that, you're done. And the next step is to put on your uh, screen protector. So the next and final step is that you need to install your screen protector. The screen protector is fairly easy to install. The steps you would need to do is to apply your hands with both this water resistant thing and the next thing you would need to do after that is spray your device as so and simply remove this peel and simply put it on as you apply and finish spraying and uh, remove the excess moisture. The product would look like this and it would uh, approximately take 12 to 20 uh, four hours for this shield to fully harden and uh, protect your device and as well as the front screen protector as you can see here I have the screen protector on as you can see it looks very nice it covers everything and I'm just going to allow this phone to uh, harden within the next 12 to 48 hours once again I'm JR Flores if you enjoyed this video please leave a thumbs up and once again this was the armor uh, suit uh, military grade uh, for your carbon fiber phones and this one is made for the epic 4G touch Galaxy S2 on Sprint and as well on Freedom Pop. The thing about it, it is that it's made in the USA so you know you're getting a great product and as well they offer lifetime warranty so which is a great thing they would automatically replace it what you're going to have to do if anything goes wrong with it simply send back the old peeled one and they'll send you out with the new brand new one which I think is an awesome deal and once again I'm JR Flores if you like this video leave a like if you uh, have something to say leave it in the comment section below I, once again I thank you for watching goodbye